the third race field, 2004 Breeders' Crown. Three-year-old pacing fillies are off. Strong start attempted by In Vitro on the outside. Pentidepressant was on a break. Glowing report, second best away. Look at In Vitro. Paul McDonnell has ambushed the field in the first few strides and was on top by two, first time under the wire. We'll see if that's the storyline of this one. Glowing report was away in second. The huge favorite, Rainbow Blue, sat at the inside third. Apple Crisp got away in fourth. Over to the quarter pole in 25 and four with the East. Tailwind assisted first quarter leader in vitro up front by two uh, glowing report away in second rainbow blue uh, on the inside third with a decision to make there on the way to the halfway point but she's staying put ahead of apple crisp armbro bombay pops out there goes rainbow blue up on the attack on in vitro still second to last is ld's val penti depressant again off stride rainbow blue uh, powering through the east wind uh, and to the lead over in vitro 55 and one and to the final turn of the 2004 Breeders' Crown. Rainbow Blue pulled third to first. A few strides after the half there. That was record speed in the opening quarter and just missed a crown record for the half. Rainbow Blue, the leader onto the final turn. On in vitro, Armbro Bombay first over. Glowing Report locked third on the inside. LD's Val is lurking second over and soon may be coming three lanes wide to the head of the stretch. Then it's Apple Crisp and out of it early was Penti to present. Rainbow Blue into the head of the stretch and what a match this is going to be. In vitro was on her back, is now three lengths back. Here comes LD's Val with stretch pace. 124 and three, 29 and two in the third. And Pierce is just keeping this pacing Philly machine going. Rainbow Blue left her rivals very blue again. She's the Breeders' Crown Champion over in vitro. LD's Val and Glowing Reports in 151, tying the Breeders' Crown record authoritatively. Rainbow Blue.